Hey, it's Mimi from UnlockingMartha.com. Today, I am going to do a really quick video. I'm going to share with you all my top 10 kitchen items that I pick up from Dollar Tree. And at a dollar, I kind of feel like, I mean, every kitchen might need these items or something similar. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. Um, my first item is spray bottles. I mentioned on my blog, and I also did a post that listed out the actual recipes that I use to create my own like natural cleaners and I'll include the link to that post in the description box but um, these plastic spray bottles do good and I also can write on the bottle itself so I can kind of write the recipe and what I put in it so that when it's time to refill it it's all right there um, I know they're like glass bottle options on Amazon but I mean at a dollar that's a no brainer for me Next up are these little glass bowls. This one holds a cup, that's the size. Um, there are also some that come a little bit smaller, that's a half a cup. So these bigger ones, you're gonna get three for a dollar. The other ones you'll get four for a dollar. But basically I use these because it used to be like when I did my recipes, I would just kind of like add ingredients as I go and I'm gonna start burning stuff and leaving out stuff, trying to like hurry up and add it in and whatever. You know what I'm saying. So now what I do is I go through just to make sure I have all the ingredients. First of all, I just go ahead and cut up, chop up everything, throw them in these bowls so that, time, so that when it's time to add it to the recipe, I can just pour it in like real professional, like, like you know, like Pioneer Woman, Ina, you know. Next up in the glass category are these stemless wine glasses. I love these. Love them. And every time I go, I must pick up like two or three of them. Um, I do not have a ton because my son washes dishes and he makes habit of breaking them. But at a dollar, I don't even care. And if you've ever seen these at Target or like Home Goods, you might get six for like $10, nine or $10. So at Dollar Tree, you get six for six dollars. Can't beat that. Next up, baskets. No, I'm not crazy about this orange color. But I've never met a can of gold spray paint that I didn't love. So these have a date with um, gold spray paint real soon. But these are amazing. Just for like corralling kids snacks. Um, you can stick them in your refrigerator, in your linen closet, in your pantry. Just to like store stuff. And like I said, if you don't like the actual color of it, just spray paint it. Next up file folders you know if you got kids like when they come in your kitchen is like corral central for like school papers and junk mail and just stuff like that so what i do is i put like um i rip i go through the mail rip off like stubs and stuff and i just stick them kids papers i stick them in this folder and i stick it in the junk drawer and then at the end of the week i just kind of go through everything if it needs to be like shredded or paid or um, filed away then I'll handle it then and stick this back in the junk folder. These are amazing. They are Brillo reusable wipes. They're much like I guess like paper towels but you can actually like wet them and reuse them again. I mainly use these to wipe down like the stove. I have a stove top or like the stainless steel, the refrigerator, the dishwasher, and the microwave. Um, and then you can rinse them with water and they like, they're really strong. So I love these. Like I said, eight for a dollar. Sometimes if I'm being cheap and because they're pretty big, I will cut them in half and then I get like 16 uses out of one. But I might use them for like a day or two. But like I said, I'm not like cleaning like chicken juice or anything with them. It's just like for wiping down my counters and... Um, the appliances mostly. Next up, dish rags, dish cloth, whatever you want to call it. Um, I'm kind of anal about these. These I use probably like every day. These are the main things I wash the dishes with and clean the sink and stuff like that. Um, these come like two for a dollar. Cannot beat that. Coupon organizer. I'm not a big couponer, so I don't keep these in my purse. But you know when you go through your mail, you get your bath and body works, your bed, bath, and beyond. The pizza joint up the street got a little deal going on. These are just really good when you're going through your mail. You see little coupons you want to hold on to. I just kind of throw them in here. Again, in the junk drawer. And then I know where to find these coupons when I need them. Next up is a notepad. I use these for grocery lists. If my husband's running out, I need him to remember to get something. These are just really good to have on hand. 
Um, granted, their posting notes aren't as sticky as some of the higher end ones. I mean, come on, you're just sending a note to school or something. It, it'll be fine. So at a dollar, you can't beat your notepad list. And last but not least, you can't write without your ink pens. You can probably get like 10 ink pens for a dollar. Uh, if you got kids or you just know ink pens come up missing. So these are really economical way to make sure you always have something to write with in your kitchen. All right, guys, that was it. That was my super short, fast, quick list of the top 10 items I think everybody needs to have in their kitchen. So thank you guys for watching. Make sure you thumbs up and subscribe. See you guys next time. Bye.